me take it forward with our guest this afternoon. We've got Dr. Nasir Hussain of the Congress Party, PKD Nambiar, supporter of the BJP. We bring in the BJP the on that note. We have a PKD Nambiar. Let, let the BJP respond. Mr. Nambiar, the questions will be raised on the government of the day. The house is in your control. You should have ensured there is, there is decorum maintained. How could you let this happen under your watch? It's uh, firstly, it's a shame. Uh, it's a shameful event which happened in the Karnataka uh, Legislative Council today, and whatever uh, uh, the, 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 the Congress spokesperson has said has no merit. Firstly, it's a it's, it's a democratic process. If uh, the government or uh, the opposition have a no confidence motion, or uh, not not having a confidence on the chair, they can always ask for a no confidence motion. So, uh, also, Sonal, if you really look at it, Congress and JDS have been a combined and ruled Karnataka for the last six years. Uh, uh, the, the last government was there. And where is the question? If both the chairperson and as well as the deputy chairperson, one is from the Congress and second is from the JDS, where is the question of BJP coming to this picture? I believe that uh, the, the Congress is not at all able to digest the very fact that they are not anymore in the power. They are not able to... Uh, even in the, the recent uh, bypolls have also shown that Congress is uh, almost getting decimated in uh, Karnataka and in the entire South for that matter. So they are, uh, I mean, uh, doing everything which is uh, simply not acceptable in a democratic uh, process. I think it's a highly condemnable act what happened in uh, Karnataka Legislative Council today. I think it's the right of the opposition or for that matter the government or anybody to have a con uh, no, no confidence motion. If they have it, they should be able to move. I think it's, it's a really a shameful act what happened in Karnataka today, Sonal. All right, but you are the government of the day, Mr. Nambiar. Uh, the so BJP that, is in that, power. That, you should have ensured there is decorum in the house. Single, uh, Sonal, have you seen a single... Uh, MLC of uh, the, the, the ruling government is... Uh, uh, but you let it happen, Mr. Night. Nambiar. Well, you, could have called in the, you could have called in the marshals. You could have ensured so that there is decorum in the, the house. Trying to that. So this is a spectacle you want to portray about seen. the opposition. Isn't that correct? No, no I think, uh, see, you expect a, a certain degree of uh, behavior from the elected representatives in an assembly. Don't you expect that? It is not a simple market. Even in a normal market, such kind of an activity do not happen. Do you expect an MLC or the elected representatives go and manhandle the deputy chairperson in this level? If that is something anybody expects, even for that matter, I think this cannot happen in a, uh, in a, uh, in a Congress uh, with, with the Congress MLCs. Nowhere else it, you can see such kind of incident. Okay, gentlemen, I'm afraid I have to leave it there. We leave it there. These are extremely disturbing and quite embarrassing pictures for all MLCs over there. I have to end it there for the moment, but we'll return to the story to see what happens and if there is any action that is taken and we get to the root of who actually started this entire menace.